coming in. Temperatures this afternoon a little cooler than yesterday because we did have that mild cold front move in. I do anticipate us to hit that 60 degree mark. So majority of the afternoon will be spent in those upper 50s to low 60s. Then as we head overnight, we're going to have those clouds moving in and that's going to keep temperatures incredibly mild as we do start out tomorrow morning. Now rain chances, yeah, they're in the forecast five out of the next seven days, but this is not going to be a washout. If you are homeschooling or you've got working from home, you still have plenty of opportunities to get out. Today's going to be a good one to do so. We're going to have some rain showers pushing in overnight. That's why we've got that high percentage 60 for tomorrow, but all that should be out of there by late morning, early afternoon. Friday's rain goes into the evening hours and we'll be out of here by early Saturday before we have a dry day Sunday and we'll see some moderate activity Monday as well as Tuesday. So for the rain for tomorrow, this is really going to push in later on this evening going overnight tonight around 2, 3, 4, 5 a.m. by 7 should be off the coast with just a few lingering showers right behind. You'll get the dry afternoon as we head into our Thursday. Friday is going to be dry and definitely warm, a high of 85 degrees. Winds are going to kick up ahead of our next system that will bring some rain showers, even the potential for an isolated thunderstorm. At this time, I've not looked to see anything severe. 61 on Saturday, Sunday, 53, followed by 50s and 60s to go on into next week.